West Texas A&M University launched their One West campaign on September 23rd, 2021. And now, around 18 months after their public launch, they have announced they've reached their goal of $125 million. KAMR Local 4's Princess Bryant was there as they made that announcement earlier today. That story, some good news tonight at 6. According to officials with West Texas A&M University, the One West campaign is the largest fundraising effort ever undertaken across the panhandle. Officials say throughout the campaign, money has been raised for scholarships, professorship, and names of buildings and rooms. Money has also been given to support academic programs and enhance institutional offerings research. One West was a concept that we worked to develop that really did a couple of things. One um, was to identify our mission and our aspiration to be the Panhandle's University, to take that responsibility very, very serious. WTAMU President Dr. Walter Winler says that although the campaign has reached this historic goal, the campaign will continue on until 2025. Our campaign, we have gifts from almost every small community, every large community in the Texas Panhandle. We heard this morning, White Deer, um, uh, actually Skelly Town. You know, these are small communities, but people are pride of the communities and they're, they're, they have pride in their communities and they have pride in WT. So this is, uh, in a sense, I'm gonna call it evidence of that. David Schaefer, Campaign Leadership Committee co-chair says that WTAMU has never raised this amount of money before, but since the launch of the campaign, he has seen the community step up and show their support. It's one of those that question whether we could really step out and raise $125 million, but yet the public has stepped up. They've seen the value of, of WT and they know what WT means to this region. WTMU student Louise Alcall says that it's great to see all the opportunities that are coming to WT, not only for current students, but future students as well. Live in studio, Princess Bryant, KMR Local 4 News. Jackie? Princess, thank you. Raspberry says the university wants to build a foundation that will allow them to continue to grow for the next 100 years to come.